All right, so it's about 9.30. We've been up since eight o'clock. Finally got about two and a half more hours of sleep last night. Um, but Cooper just had breakfast. He had muffins and a yogurt and some apple juice. I just fed the baby his oatmeal with his bottle. He put the oatmeal in his bottle. Um, I've got to go do a background and a drug screen this morning for a new job that I'm taking in January. Hold on. And I will tell y'all about that later. We just made it back home. It's 2.30. I feel beat. Um, so tired from just all the driving and having to get in and out with the baby and Cooper. Um, so we definitely are not going anywhere tomorrow. And my cabinets are open back there for some reason. Um, so I don't know what we're doing for the rest of the day. Probably planning to take it pretty easy. I'm gonna heat up some leftover pizza. There's only two pieces left. So I'm gonna eat that for lunch. Cooper had a peanut butter and jelly Uncrustable and a Lunchable and some chocolate milk um, for lunch. If I can get this open, hold on. And then um, we got the uh, Lunchables. I had just packed an Uncrustable for him. I didn't expect to be out so long. Um, I had to go do my background check and drug screen and the school board closed from 12 to one for lunch. And we made it over there right at 12 o'clock. So there was a Dollar Tree right down the road and he was still hungry after eating his Incrustable. So he ran down there and got a bunch of Lunchables. Um, I need to grab them out of my car and a few other things. So I guess I'll show y'all what I got. It's not enough for a haul because it's a lot of multiples of the same things. So we did that while we waited. And then he ate the Lunchable and he got a chocolate milk. So he ate that or drank that. And um, so that's kind of how we occupied our time for that hour. And now we are back home. I need to grab the diaper bag out of the car because I was just trying to get Cooper in to lay him down for a nap, which I just laid him down for a nap. And I have not eaten yet. I'm just not a big fast food person too much anymore. Um, since I was pregnant, I just can't handle it. And it just doesn't taste right to me anymore. So the only really fast food I'll eat is pizza. Um, so those two little pieces of leftover pizza is what I'm having for lunch and probably some yogurt or something with it. Um, and Mason will be ready for a bottle anytime now. So I also need to wash bottles. I also need to wash dishes left over from last night. I just didn't do them um, because Nick left at midnight and um, to go back to work. And then I also need to fill my stocking stuffer and Christmas videos. Um, so I may at least try to knock out one of the stocking videos today. Um, so we will see what I get done, but I'm going to go out to the car, grab that diaper bag and the stuff out of the trunk from Dollar Tree and show you what I got. I don't know if these were a good deal, but they're the Lunchable brand and they're Turkey and Cheddar Cracker Stackers. So I got two of those. Well, I actually got three, but Cooper ate one of those on the way home. And then I bought two of the Ham and Cheddar ones. I got one of the nachos. I don't really know if it was a good deal, but went ahead and picked them up. Uh, Cooper likes muffins in the morning for breakfast, but sometimes they get a little pricey after a while. So I'm trying to slowly incorporate some other stuff, just easy breakfast stuff, because Cooper's gonna be eating breakfast at school when we start back, I start back at work in January. Um, so he's just gonna need a little something until we make it to school or daycare. Um, so I've just been, he's been eating muffins, but I'm gonna see if he likes these little toast them Pop-Tart Blueberry. I also picked up, because of the holidays coming up, they had the Mrs. Field sugar cookies. They also had the one with the candy in them, but I like sugar cookies and we already have some, I think, sugar cookie mix in there. So I got these, they, I got two of those. They make uh, six cookies each, which is enough for me and Cooper. I wanted these and I don't know if they're a good deal, but I picked them up. I've never seen this brand before. It's the Bella Rosa, um, and it's sharp cheddar cheese, roasted, sea salted cashews, and cherry juice infused dried cranberries. And I got, they had a few different flavors, but this is the only one it looked like that I would actually eat. So, got two of those. Cooper wanted Jello, so he always, when he goes to my mom's, has Jello. And so, I picked up some Jello for him to have to have these little tin pack of like cookies they have oreos chocolate chip ones um and different ones but i like to have a 
something like this to throw in the diaper bag really easy for things like today. Um, so I got a box of those. I got two boxes. I like the, I need some fiber in my diet. Um, I've had some issues with that lately, so I don't really need too much, but I picked up these high in fiber Sunbest lemon cake bar. They're like a granola bar basically, and I have a basket just for granola bars in the pantry. So I got two boxes of those, and then I also got two boxes of the chocolate brownie bar, which is my favorite from Dollar Tree. Also picked up these. I just bought gal uh, quart, quart size Ziploc bags, but I never picked up any sandwich size Ziploc bags. And they had the dinosaur train. They also had Berenstein Bears, but Cooper likes dinosaurs. So I just picked up this one and it was actually 35 bags. You got more than what you did in the Dollar Tree brand. Um, I'm almost out of my liquid foundation and Dollar Tree has a new makeup line and so it's called be pure and it's essentially ageless hydrating serum foundation and it's a 0.5 fluid ounce for $1.25 so I picked that up to try out because I'm almost out of my elf foundation and then I like these little jelly hair spirals I had some and I was gonna put my hair up in the car because it was getting hot um, but I didn't have any hair ties so I tried to pick up these and I forgot I had picked them up. So I've got another pack of hair ties now. This little gray basket to put fruit in on the counter because we eat a lot of fruit. And then I picked up five of these to go in the pantry. I want one for like individual snacks like that. One I have one for granola bars and just different things like that. So I picked up five of those. And that's all from Dollar Tree. So I'm fixing to eat my lunch and see what I get done. So it is like seven o'clock now and time got away from me today. Um, Cooper did not end up falling asleep, but he watched a movie in his bed and Hayden ended up coming over after school. So he just ate dinner and left and it's just been hectic over here since lunch. Sorry, I am trying to make a bottle while I'm talking to y'all. Um, so it's been kind of hectic over here, hence as to why I have not picked up the camera. So it's just been really crazy. Um, and the pizza that I picked up in my grocery haul, the three of them that I bought, because Nick's not here, we only, we went through, well, Hayden wanted pizza. Cooper wanted pizza as well. And we had a case of diarrhea earlier with Cooper, but I'm just kind of watching if he hasn't done it again. So I'm thinking maybe he just ate something that upset his stomach. Um, but, Ended up making pizza. Hayden ate the whole first pizza by himself. And so he went back home after he ate because he has school tomorrow. So I went ahead and fed him first. Did not think he was going to eat a whole pizza. So I just made the second one while Cooper's in the bath. Bathing him and then we're going to eat. So we went through both of those pizzas. Well, we'll probably have a half a pizza left for tomorrow for lunch. But um, I had pizza for lunch going to have it again for dinner and I'll probably have it again tomorrow for lunch as well. So pizza has been easy and good in this house for everybody. So if everybody's happy. I'm good to go. And if they want pizza and it makes them happy, then that's what it is. Um, so we've had pizza like five times the last week. It's just an easy go-to for me. Um, so I'm warming up the baby's bottle because he's awake off and on and fixing to bathe Cooper feed him some pizza, and I'm going to show you this mess around my kitchen. They had fun with Play-Doh, but I'm kind of upset because it's on the new floors. We just laid these floors. So, yeah. We are planning on taking, we've got a bar, like a taller kitchen table bar type style. We're planning on giving this table to Nick's sister because she just got her own place and she's having a baby in like three weeks. This is my old table I've had since I was with Cooper's dad and we've had this table for like four years. So it's about time to pass it on to somebody else. We're getting the, we have bar chairs in there that go to the table. We just have not taken the island out of storage for it. So we've got to do that so we can get rid of this table. But if y'all have any suggestions on how to keep Play-Doh from getting all over the floor and all over the table, please let me know because I feel like I'm running crazy with my head cut off 
And the same thing for crayons. Every time he colors, they end up all over the floor. So I'm going to turn this bath water off and I'm gonna give Cooper a bath before this tub overflows. So I just fed Mason his bottle. It is eight o'clock, I think. Well, it's 8.15. Um, and I looked at the TV and it told me the time. I just got Cooper to bed, just bathed Mason and gave him his bottle. Um, and so we got the bathroom cleaned up. Well, it's not cleaned up, but the water drained so I can get my bath. I still need to eat dinner, um, take a bath. And I also wanna try and film at least one of my stocking stuffer videos tonight because I have not done that and I don't get any time I do that other than at night because Cooper does not nap. He lays down in bed and watches a movie for two hours. So the only time I have to film Christmas videos like this is when he's not here or at night. So I'm gonna try and film one tonight so I can go ahead and get it out for y'all. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. There's a lot going on and I may try and vlog again tomorrow. Bye guys.